hang for what you've done to Jose. Step back and shut up. Kid, why can't we go back home to Taos now? Look at that. The horse is throwing his dragon, it's right. He may be alive. Let's go. Remember from the last time we visited Jose Ortega? Is there nothing that. No, he's dead. How can a good horseman get caught in his lasso like that? He couldn't. I could understand him getting his arm or his leg caught, but that lariat's been completely looped around his body. His arms are even pinned to his sides. That's right, Kit. Well, you do what you can for him. I'll ride on ahead up to the Bolton Ranch. San Francisco. When? You only missed him by a few days. Anything I can do for you? No, oh, thank you. Something wrong at the Bolton Ranch. I'd like to get inside the hacienda and look around. Good, then we'll both get in. No, there only seems to be one man around the place, so you go to the front door and keep him busy while I look around inside. I always gets the dull work to do. What to do? Keep Ed been busy for 15 minutes, and when I want you back here, I'll make a call like a lark. Well, there are no larks in this part of the country, amigo. I know it. But what's the sense of imitating a bird that does not exist here, amigo? There'll only be one lark, and I'll be it. That's the sense of it. Now get going. Tell 
Two, I'm a blacksmith. You've never seen such a blacksmith. Once I shoot four horses in one hour. That's official. I was stunned by a sundial. I'm an expert wheelwright. I can repair wagons, rakes, plows. I can also cook. I can cook chile, tamales, enchiladas, frijoles, tacos. I can cook roast beef, fried chicken. I can do a lot. Senor, in my blood flows some of the purest blood of all Castile. Not much, but a little. I demand an apology. You'll get it. <laughs> What's going on around here, Ray? I just found Jose dead. He's been murdered. And what Edmund told me is true. They have abducted Margarita. Who is Edmund? Uh, he is one of a pack of criminals that poured into California from all over the world in the last year. sign a bill of sale for the ranch, he won't harm Margarita. What's the promise of a man like Edmund Worth? I don't know, but I can't take a chance on them harming my daughter. <laughs> Edmund's already telling people you sold out and left the country. Don't you realize he'll kill you the minute you sign the ranch over to him? He'll have Margarita killed if he finds me gone. I've got a different idea. Edmund's here alone. You better talk or do I have to beat it out of you? Don't bruise your hands on him. It's my daughter he's threatened to kill and my ranch he's trying to steal, Kit. Kit? Yes, Kit Carson. My daughter's all I have to live for, Edmund. Now I'm going to ask you this question just once. Where is she? She'll be at the inn at Las Altas until dark. And after dark? I don't know. Gonzalez is going to take her somewhere. Who's Gonzalez? The innkeeper. Where is he taking her? Across the border? I don't know. You better talk. I've told you all I know. I guess he's taking her to some relative of his. Keep an eye on him. I can get to Las Altas before dark. Waiting for your signal. Weren't you supposed to keep Edmund talking until I called you? See, but I run out of words. Well, all right, let's get going. We gotta be to Las Alas before dark. I'm hurt. Please get me a drink of water. I'll leave you here while I go after it. And take me out to the well. You'll have the drop on me all the way. You'll stay right where you are till Carson gets back. Please. Give me a drink of water. Did you show any pity for my daughter or Jose? I didn't tell him to kill Jose. He must have attacked them. Was he attacking them when they dragged him to death behind a horse? Dragged him? I didn't know that. I swear it. And what about my other help that you and your gang ran off this ranch the last couple of weeks? They weren't hurt. We just scared them off. Well, how did you scare them? Kill their women? Did you steal their children? Nobody was hurt. We just talked them into leaving. To make it tougher for you to run the place. I see. You wanted to beat me down. Get me in a better mood to sell the ranch for the return of my daughter and no money. You figured I couldn't fight alone, and that's why you had them kill Jose. Water. I'm hurt bad. Down deep inside where Carson hit me. Maybe my daughter will bring you some water when she comes home. 
she isn't coming home. What did you say? They didn't take her to Los Altos. I was just playing for time. Didn't know how bad I was hurt then. I figured if I got Carson out of the way, maybe I could get the jump on you. Where is she? No use getting tough, Bolton. I figure I'm just about through. Where is she? Water. I can't talk. Edmund, where is she? Right near here. Let me drink. Talk first. You know the stone hut? Some miner built in that uh, canyon. Go on. She's in there. They were supposed to tie her up and leave her. So when you made the deal, I could take you to her. Now let me drink. Take it easy. You'll choke. your horse well in the underbrush. We're right on the edge of town. Too bad that pretty senorita Margarita does not know you're coming to call on her. You forget about pretty senoritas. And don't even look at one while you're in town. You've got no time for romance. For how long have I been your right arm and still you don't know me from your left? And don't forget we've got a lot of work to do before dark. I got a head like an elephant. I never forget nothing. First I look through town like a tramp with my eyes and ears open and my mouth shut. Then I locate the carriage and the horses. All right, I guess you know your job, all right. few sheep, Mr. Gonzalez. Pedro Gonzalez. How do you do? I think I'll get something to eat first, and then you can show me to my room. Huevos con amor? Yes, I can serve you ham and eggs, senor. This does not change our plans, understand? We leave for the border as soon as it's dark. With him in the place, it will be wise to get rid of the girl as soon as possible. I'll get over to the stable and take care of the horses. Wouldn't it be funny if Los Altos was the end of the trail for Kit Carson? It better be, or it might be the end of the trail for us. Don't worry, he will not disturb you. I shall attend to his coffee myself. Some coffee, please. Tamale, senor? You look tired and hungry. 
Sit down and rest while I serve you. I watched you walking down the road. I was sad. I made you sad? Yes, such a handsome man to look so tired. You must eat to restore your strength. The chicken tamales are wonderful. Shall I prepare one? Oh, please do me a favor. And why don't you have one yourself to keep me company while I eat? Gracias, senor. You're the most beautiful senorita in California. Where do you come from, senor? Taos. You walked all the way from Taos? Oh, Taos is 1,500 kilometers from here. <laughs> I guess I won't have coffee after all. Thank you. Thank you for a very fine dinner, Senor Gonzalez. Now you can show me to my room. Follow me. Where do you think you're going? I was going to ask Senor Gonzalez when he went supper. He'll let you know when he's ready. Nice room, eh? You like it? I'll take the key. Oh, yes, the key. I opened the window for you. Oh, don't trouble. It's no trouble. That's too bad. It's the only room I have left. You know, a nervous traveler slept in here. He was afraid he'd get robbed by someone coming from the balcony. He must have nailed the window shut. I'd come back later and fix it. Oh, don't bother. It's cool enough in here. As a matter of fact, don't bother about anything. I'll be all right. Why do you stay in Los Altos, senor? Looking for an opportunity. You a sheep man? No, I just sold a few. You interested in a ranch? I got a good friend here, a big rancher. Maybe you know him. His name is Senor Ray Bolton. No, I'm not interested in a ranch. That's for a married man. Senor Bolton is not married now, but he has a beautiful daughter. Very beautiful. No, I'll just look around the countryside for a day or two, and if I don't see what I want, I'll, I'll just drift. Have a good sleep, Senor Wanderer. We followed those Apache hostages for three days and three nights without stopping for food or water. How did you track them over the mountains? For me, that is nothing. I can follow the tracks of a field mice. How long are you going to stay in Los Altos, senor? How long am I going to stay in Los Altos? Hasta la vista. Gracias, senor. Loco. Take him around front. I'll tell Pedro we're ready.
Kit Carson's here in Los Altos to get the girl. He knows about her? He knows everything. We take her out of the room now. Margarita, and don't stop for anything. Dad taught me how to use a gun when I was 10 years old. Toro, on your horse. I don't think he'll have any more trouble around here. Well, the country's new, big. When the law does get its hands on a criminal, justice moves quickly. Thanks again, Kit. Goodbye, El Toro. Kit, do we go to Los Altos after we put these hombres in the presidio? Why? I got a chicken tamale that I like to finish. Start walking.